everybody, this is Moy to MGS, and today I'm going to show you more Bucky Ball tips and tricks. So let's start off by just telling you some notes. First of all, last week I said that I'm going to show you a picture of the hexagon. Some of you may have noticed that it was at the end of the video. I'm sorry, I'll try not to let that happen again. Second of all, I'm using my 3DS camera. I just got this for Christmas. It's really nice. So the quality may be a little different from other things. But let's just get started with Bug Bond. Okay, so we're going to make Hexagon, like I said. So we'll start off by making the chain. Everybody knows what the chain is. It's the long line of all your Buckyballs. Okay, let's get this back a little. As I always say, Buckyballs are really fun for the family. Do mostly anything with them. But sometimes it's really hard to do some of these, so that's why I'm here. I'm here to help you on these sculptures. You may be thinking like other people going to be like, oh, that looks so cool, and you have them, and you have no idea what the heck to do with them. So, you do it this way. You just watch these videos, and you can subscribe to me, and I will probably do these, like, every so often. I don't know. Sometimes I will, sometimes I won't. Upload. Okay. Sometimes I will use a different camera, too. So... Most of these things I will be changing for a while sometimes. So now that we are done with the whole thing, let's look at this chain. It is very, very, very long. Let's see. It is big as the rug, actually, if you look. It's a big rug, actually. Not that big. I don't know how big it is. But, okay, so we are done with this part. Let's start wrapping. Let's move that right there. Okay, let's start. First, you need a hole in the middle. If you don't want that, I'll show you how to um, redo that at the end of this video. Okay, so you can make a hole as big as you want. Do it that big. Oops. Do it that big. Do it that small. Right down here. I usually do it that big. I think even smaller. I'll just check. Yeah, I do it that small. So let's start wrapping. You want to start off on the ground. The ground is the easiest place to get. And you want to go around the side so it doesn't go off the edge. If it goes off the edge, just like that right there. Try to push it down. So you want to keep this perfect. You can do it like this too. But I recommend doing it on the ground, a table, wherever you do your buggy bond. Okay. So you practically do this. Right now it looks like practically nothing. It looks like it, well, won't really turn out to be great. But it will, trust me. I have done this a lot of times. I have the gold edition, so it is actually pretty cool, actually. I'll say that. It'll be cool when it turns out. You imagine a hexagon being gold? It looks great. Okay, so this is our progress so far. I'll show you the line. We have left. Not that much. We did most of it. And it has a design sometimes, if you see. I don't think the camera can see this. But sometimes there will be, like, little gaps, but they're not really gaps. They just all have, like, a line through the middle. Like, if you see right here, you can see that it's just all gapped up. Let's show you right down there. It's gapped up. Oh, now I can't even see it. Right down there, see those little holes? They get bigger. It'll come in random places. Right now, 
I'm just getting it right. Sorry, try my best. Up there. Is that up a little? Goes all the way up. It's pretty cool. So let's start rapping again. So if you don't want the hole, I'll show you that in a minute. Because I am almost done. Okay. First, you need extras. Let's see if I have any extras. Yes, I do. Barely. One right there. So you gotta peel that part off. Because if you just take one off, it won't look that good. So you, you have this still. Now, you take one of those extras that you have and then stick it right in that middle I'm looking off this camera sorry stick it in the middle right there and then if it gets jammed and pat it when it's got jammed okay so there you have it I'll show you in a sec sorry it's kind of hard you have your hexagon. So it this way. Very nice. Now you can do cool stuff with it. Like this. Curl it up. Smash it. Then you have this. It's a trapezoid now. The last stuff you can do. Let's wrap it out. Put it through. Untake that. There you go. You have it. So, now it is a time to destroy this hexagon. It is kind of hard, but we'll do it. Let's try doing it this way. One, two, three. That works. So now that we destroyed that, we're back to our buckball and hexagon. You have your buckyballs again. But, next time we'll be doing a game that I made up. And it is another chain game. So I'll show you that next time. But right now, we'll see you soon. So, see you soon. Thanks for watching.